Gibbs Gaming. Welcome back gamers to Gibbs Gaming and in this video we're going to cover the add-ons that I think are the most important and again that's a personal opinion but the most important for World of Warcraft Shadowlands. So let's get started. It's going to be quite a big list so I apologize you're more than welcome to pause the video and take note of all of the different add-ons that I'll be using. First and foremost is Ability Team Tracker. This is really good if you're in a group of uh, friends or in a random dungeon or even a raid to know what abilities that benefit the raid are capable of being used or have been used by the team. The next one is Addy Bags, which gives you a new layout for your bags to make it more customizable. The presets are pretty good to where you can have it, or where it's preset anyway, to put weapons, armor, junk, all in separate bags for you so that you can quickly go through, find new gear that's dropped or things that you just need to sell. Alto Altaholic is good if you're going to be like me and have a ton of alt characters so you need to know who's got mail, who's got money, you know, what guilds are they in, things like that. But the big one for me is Auctioneer and Auctionator. So Auctioneer and Auctionator I use at the exact same time because what these will do is allow you to use the auction house to its maximum efficiency. So if you're wanting to make money, that's how you do it right there. It's going to scan the auction house, regardless of what server you're on, and find out what the average running price is for pretty much everything in the game. If it's being sold, you're going to know about it. An auctionator actually allows you to go in and preset a undercut system to where when you want to sell things, you can undercut somebody as low as 1% to a maximum of 100%. It's entirely up to you how you want to do that, but it is a great way to help you make money as you level. Next is going to be big wigs as well as little wigs. We'll get down to that one here in a minute. These are going to help you stay out of combat situations that would normally kill you. Uh, coupled with little wigs so that you can get dungeons, raids, overworld, even quests. These are customizable and you can go in and change it however you would like. Data store. This is basically the easiest way the computer can keep everything that you do in one local area so that you can see all your characters, how much money everybody has, everything. It's kind of the same as Altolic, that's why this one's not uh, turned on right now, but Data Store is. Um, so it really just depends on how much space basically you want to take up on your computer by downloading either this one or the other one. Next is Details Damage Meter. This actually has the most customizable options for damage meters that you can get. It's, in my opinion, way better than Recount, but you can try both to see how you like it. Next, we have GTFO, which is basically a giant siren to tell you that you are in things that you should not be in. Handy Notes, as well as Handy Notes Shadowlands. Helps you see where rares are, chests, things like that on your map. You have Ice HUD. That gives you a really cool little display around your character, where your health bar is, mana, energy, that kind of stuff. Here's Little Wigs. Like I said, this actually helps you with all of your dungeons, raids, things like that. Max DPS. I have this because if I'm learning a new character, I don't know what spells or what skills I should be using. So I really rely on this to kind of help me learn that class. And it's a really good thing if you're a brand new player or you're brand new to that class. So it comes as every class in the game. And it will help you with the DPS and tanking aspects. Unfortunately, it does not work very well with healing because healing is situational. So you kind of have to learn that one on your own. Minimap button frame actually makes it to where my minimap is not cluttered with every mini button that they give me. Sexy map changes the look of my maps. Um, 
for one. Uh, stream buddy is uh, good for when I'm streaming, so that if I'm in a team, I can click one button that lets the random group know that I am streaming uh, and where to find me if necessary. Uh, Stubby helps other add-ons. Swatter, same thing. Talent set manager, that allows me to switch my talent points with gear. Uh, so that if I have different sets of gear for different types of uh, talents that I want, it will auto-switch for me there. Uh, I keep threat plates turned off because detail actually gives that to you. Uh, Tom Tom works in conjunction with uh, World uh, Wow Pro Guides. These guys are fantastic in teaching you how to level quickly and efficiently. Uh, and Tom Tom just points you in the direction you need to go. Weak Auras is awesome because you can actually use uh, third-party aura websites that will preset a bunch of auras for you so that you have them all around your character so that you can see different spells and you know different things that you need to keep track of. Elf UI is my UI interface. It cleans everything up for me, kind of moves it out of the way, gives me different options. Narcissus is really cool if I'm wanting to take screenshots of my character or if I'm wanting to look at different pieces of gear closer up to see how it looks on my character. And then, of course, I have Deadly Boss Mods, which gives me a bunch of information as well as timers for different bosses. Well, that's all the add-ons I have. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you have any questions, leave me that down in the comment section below. If there's an add-on you think I should be using, also leave me that down in the comment section below. I would love to check those out. This is Chris at Gibbs Gaming. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you're not subscribed, please make sure you hit the subscribe button, hit the bell notification so you can stay up to date with all of the videos that we do. Hope everybody's being safe out there. And as one, we rise stronger and wiser. Peace out, guys. Bye!